Today I will discuss about how to measure amplitude of accommodation and near point of accommodation in minus lens method. Requirements We need patient near vision chart and trial set. In the trial set we will be needed trial frame, occluder and minus spherical trial lenses. Measuring amplitude of accommodation Procedure Request the patient to sit comfortably. Ask the patient to wear the spectacle or other optical correction and occlude the left eye. The patient's attention is directed towards the best corrected near visual equity target at 40 cm testing distance. The patient is asked to report the first sustained blur as minus lenses are added in front of the eye in 0.25 diopter steps. Suppose we have added 0.25 minus spherical trial lenses and patient is saying the target is clear. So we will increase minus 0.25 diopter more. So let's add 0.5. Patient is saying target is still clear. So now let's add minus 0.75. Still patient is saying it's clear. Let's add minus 1. Still it's clear. Now suppose the minus lenses added to report fast sustained blur is minus 4 diopter. That means with the minus 4 diopter, the patient is able to appreciate the fast sustained blur. Since the test is done at 40 cm distance, the stimulus to accommodation for that distance that is 2.5 diopter spherical should be numerically added to the resulting minus lens power to obtain the accommodative amplitude. So the final amplitude of accommodation will be 4 plus 2.5 or 6.5 diopter. Now occlude right eye and repeat the procedure for the left eye. How to identify near point of accommodation? The formula is NPA is equal to 100 divided by AOA. Here NPA is equal to near point of accommodation, AUA is equal to amplitude of accommodation. So NPA is equal to 100 divided by 6.5 or NPA is equal to 15.38 or 15 centimeter. Stay with smart optometry and study optometry smartly.